Reactor for DaVinci Resolve is an incredible source for free effects and macros, but how does it work? How do you utilize the tools it makes accessible? Let's break it down. Reactor is a free source package manager created by the We Suck Less community that allows users to access tons of awesome tools, effects, and macros created by the public. If you like it, give us a thumbs up and subscribe to stay tuned for future videos where we dig into some of the individual tools inside Reactor. It's really easy to install. First, click the link in the description to find the download. Once you've got it on your computer, just drag and drop it from your desktop into the node tree area of Fusion. Select from the list anything that you want to use. Some tools recommend a donation, and while donating to the creator of a tool you love is awesome, it isn't mandatory. It's also good to know that most of these will work in the free version of Resolve, although some only function in the studio version. Unfortunately, there's not really a good way to know from the list alone which ones will work in studio or free, but go ahead and try them out and see what works. To get back to this list at any time, from the workspace menu, select Scripts, and then Reactor. Once you've chosen the plugins you want to use, they'll be available through the new node search, which is accessible by hitting Control Space. If you're not a Fusion Pro yet, it might take a little bit of messing around and searching the web to figure out how to use each tool or effect from Reactor. If you can't find an explanation you're satisfied with, let me know in the comments what you need help with, and make sure you're subscribed with notifications on so you don't miss our video on the topic you want to hear. And of course, until next time, take care of yourself and each other.